to Superior Sunrise, like I said, a very special guest, PJ Beller. PJ, I said earlier before you came on, you're from South Africa, but you live in the States now with your wonderful wife, Kula. I know people see you, they meet you, and they're like, what are you doing over here? I know you're around livestock and ag agriculture over in South Africa, but just kind of give us the backstory on your life and then what brought you to the States. Yeah. Kirby, thank you so much for having me. Um, like, like you said, I'm from South Africa, and uh, we were raised on a, a fifth-generation cattle operation, yeah. originally uh, from Irish descent. <laughs> and just from a young age, uh, the American cattle industry and the American culture intrigued me, and I was always going to get here, and got here as quick as I could. And Fort Worth was a natural fit for what we wanted to do in uh, creating a global headquarter for the registered cattle business. Speaking of a global headquarter for the cattle business, that's what you do here. You have the cattlemarket.net. Tell us a little bit about that and how you really connect people internationally just in the business. So uh, it's a three-pronged approach. Uh, the first one is creating awareness around the world with what's going on in, in different countries with beef cattle industries. And uh, that's, that's been a challenge is bringing the world together as far as that's concerned. The second approach is, is creating goodwill between those different associations and breeders. And then thirdly, we launch that into trade, and that's what the cattlemarket.net does with trade. So we've got various initiatives we run um, through the year, bringing international groups to the, the stockyards and to Fort Worth and, and to Texas ranches. And then we also run a world championship for, for different breeds. And we found this has been the best way of getting leaders around the world in each breed together and then exposing them to the Texas ranches. Well, speaking of the World Championship, I know you have one coming up here in Texas. Tell us a little bit about that. So the Angus Champion of the World is, is coming up in May. Um, we've got people coming from all six continents going to be staying wow. in the stockyards. And uh, from there, we'll go down to Stephenville where there's a, a big jubilee happening in Stephenville, the Collier Diamond Sea Jubilee, where we'll announce the World Champion Bull and Female. And from there, we'll tour various ranches. And then we've got a very uh, cool initiative happening with TCU Ranch Management. Oh, wow. And w each one of our groups does a seminar to the students, uh, question and answers on various ranching topics uh, w which are relevant to the country that they're from. And the students have a great time in being exposed to different industries, but then we found our international guests probably learn more than the students <laughs> do in the feedback from the students. And this has allowed us to uh, put some students in contact with Australian uh, ranches where they've been hired to go and, and work over there. And TC Ranch Management has also been set up with projects in Kazakhstan and, oh, wow. and Australia uh, due to this back and forth, which has been fun to watch. Well, you and I talk about this. You're very busy. I mean, you're going in very many or different directions. I know mm -hmm. Fort Worth, you had a group of people that came internationally from all over. You had that in Denver as well, but you also judge cattle shows. So tell mm -hmm. us about that. Um, I, I just, I love cars, probably take cattle too seriously. <laughs> but uh, judging cattle has been a great way of getting around the world. I've been to 62 different countries doing uh, either cattle judging or consulting. And it's just a, it's, it's a, a vehicle to get me to uh, the rest of the world and to interact with leaders in the cattle industry around the world. Well, I think it's great to have people such as yourself, PJ, that are so passionate and involved as you are in the agriculture and livestock industry. I want to thank you for being on today. I know if anybody wants any more information, you can visit the cattlemarket.net. PJ's your guy. And when we come back, two very special guys. Don't go anywhere.